Chinese will win a silver medal tonight. And the battle now, one team left for bronze. Dorota Zagorska, Mariusz Szudek, third after the short program. And what a tough position for them to skate after that. This team has had problems with their nerves in the past. Last year at the World Championships, they were fourth after the short. Skated very poorly in the long and dropped to six. No problem there with that opening throw double axle. It's a sport, though. 
Things like that can happen. Remember, Petrova and Tikhanov are in third, but they were in fifth. This team was in third. Where will they be in a few minutes? Dorota Zagorska, Mariusz Szudek. Final pairs team of the evening. They had an er a small error, a touchdown on a throw, and then this right here could cost them. It is a concentration error. I'm sure she was probably thinking to herself, which we've all done many times, gee, we did it, it's over, We've d it's done. And something like that happens. Poland has never won a pairs medal before. Now, again, we told you before about the judging panel. A spotter has informed us that there may have been some signaling going on between the Ukrainian and Russian judge. And look at this. Watch the foot of the Russian judge. And you know what? That was a definite signal. Definite. And of all of the things that, business going on there. that we've talked about in the last year with block judging and the politics of judging, if the president of the ISU is in the building tonight, and he is Octavio Cinquanta, he may want to look at that videotape because there is no doubt those judges were commiserating. Five, eight, and they can't. Five, seven, Look at this, presentation five, marks. Five, seven, and they have five, won the bronze medal. Five, seven, despite five, what seven, the Russian and Ukrainian five, eight, judge did by putting them in fourth. They are the bronze medalists. Poland has won the bronze medal. Two history makers here tonight, China. First pairs medal ever has won a silver. Poland has won a bronze. And the Russians, Berezhnaya and Sigurlitsi, have made it two in a row. But certainly, that videotape is a black eye on skating and on judging. That will be investigated. You can rest assured. Berezhnaya, Sigurlitsi win. Christy Sargent and Chris Wirtz finish in sixth place. A personal best, but out of the medals. And for Valerie Surrett and Jean-Sebastien Fecteau, their first trip to the Worlds, they end up in 13th position. Sargent and Wirtz came in tonight looking for a bronze. It didn't happen. But let's find out their feelings. Let's join Rob Paltz. I have Chris Sargent. Christy Sargent and Chris Wirtz says, we're still discussing the situation here at the World Championships in Helsinki. You told me you were very nervous knowing you were in the final flight. Yeah, I mean, all day it's been, you know, in my mind. And you try and get it trying to get out of it but you know it just comes back to you and you know we skated as well as we could tonight and we're, we're pleased with what we did you have improved on last year's performance you started off so well you nailed the side by side um i think that that's the the gist of our routine if we get off to a great start and um i think like i said earlier to you halfway through the program we started to say okay just let her rip you know be calm now and you can't ease off and and we eased off a bit and, and we shouldn't have but um learning experience well, you've learned. You've moved up one more position. Everybody in the world knows Sergeant Wirtz. Congratulations. Thanks, Rob. Thank you.